welcome back to Holistic Healing by Tiamat. So today I was going to be bringing you an angel guidance card uh, reading, an angel oracle guidance card reading, but I decided that I would share my experience with you guys instead because this has been kind of crazy. So while I was in the middle of doing my angel guidance reading, let's hope that I find the same two cards again. I got the Archangel Raziel card, and I got a green card about healing ladies, so that was the Divine Feminine one, and the Divine, yeah, I got the same cards again, so these are the two cards that came out, um, so the Divine Masculine Collective, I'll just run through it quickly, the Divine Masculine Collective is being called to really use your, your Midas Touch powers so that you can, so that you can bring more light into the world, by Midas Touch I mean the ability to transmute light into physical resources, so you're going to be to be called to bring more gold into your life and to those who are around you. Now for women, you're going to be called to do the opposite. You're going to be called to transmute darkness into light. Now, or oh, divine feminines, not necessarily women. Um, I am rushing through this a little bit because actually, when I was in the middle of doing these these readings earlier, um, I done I done over an hour reading when I spoke about these energies in in depth. But I will just show you the card instead. And I will say spiritual gifts, Archangel Raziel. Thank you, Raziel, for helping me to channel my gifts and talents. And then we've also got express your creativity with thank you, angels, for helping me express my inner creator. So I also explained the reason why my nails are like this. My nails are like this because I'm waiting for them to grow out so that I can get my lovely white nails again. Because um, I don't really like, I like the green, but that was for me. And I don't like to use acetone. So yeah. Anyway, um, I also explained the reason why I'm not showing you the board is because I like to do my own, my own special spread. So I don't really want to, to show you my spread because this is my spread that I created myself and um, yeah that's all I really wanted to say but basically I wanted to tell you the story of what actually just happened to me. First of all I wanted to talk about how, um, before I even go into that, I wanted to talk about how I'm really sorry that my eyes keep flickering around everywhere because the other day I listened to a, a subliminal that made them do this. I am aware that they are damaging our health. That's why um, I actually said that the Divine Masculine Collective is going to be called to stop people from listening to subliminals. That was the one of the main things I said, especially to those of you who have never listened to subliminals, because if you go on my um, Instagram page, you will see that it is actually really affecting us all really badly, especially those of us who are um, who are in the public eye because we are feeling like we we need to um, listen to subliminals in order to stay safe and in order to in order to remain in the public eye. But actually, I haven't been. Um, I'm not really going to talk to you about my private life, but it's perfectly possible to do it without listening to anything. However, um, there is going to be the need for certain people, especially those within the Pisces Collective. If you know who I'm talking about, then you'll know who I'm talking about. But there are certain people who I have highlighted as sun gods, um, who I have been teaching you how to do sun dances, and I've been teaching you how to heal with light. Now you're going to be called to actually turn this into physical resources so that you can help to heal other people. And the Divine Feminine Collective is going to be called to turn your physical resources into light, so to 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 change, move and shift things. And this is going to cause you to go through a healing and transformative process. But this isn't really what I wanted to talk about today. What I really wanted to talk about today, uh, because this is really about expressing your creativity and the Divine Masculine Collective has already been creating quite a lot of things and you're going to be called to really show your creations to other people so that other people are noticing your gifts and your talents. So yes, um, but the, the main reason why I made this video today is because I wanted to talk about my daughter's spiritual powers. So for those of you who don't know, my daughter is extremely spiritually gifted. Now, if she doesn't want me to go too much into this, this is why this is happening. But um, as someone who myself practices telekinesis and telepathy, I am able to understand the messages that come to me. So while reading this card earlier, I started crying and she wants me to reveal to everybody now that she's ready to come home because when I was making the reading earlier I was talking with you guys about some some techniques that I have been doing now this squirrel came came out to prove that it's working it's all working perfectly well for for me and it, it caused me to actually 
start crying. I, I started crying and I think that's why she um, telepathically communicated with her grandma to knock on the door and then my phone started messing up afterwards because she didn't want me to cry in front of people because every time I cry in front of people it, it makes you... Um, it, it, like if you masturbate or anything like sorry <laughs> please don't show my daughter this but this is what she wants me to tell other people but if you are um doing that over me crying what you're doing is you're manifesting me crying more so she wanted me to not cry on camera so that people <laughs> manifest me smiling and happy and knowing that she's coming home to me because she wants me to let everybody know how how much i love her and how much I'm excited for this <laughs> because she says that um, no one wants to take everything away from me I thought that everyone wanted to take everything away from me but it's actually the opposite everyone wants to to gift me gift me things back and I don't want to take things from people I really don't that's why <laughs> if you know what my uh, moves like I'm not gonna go into it but anyway uh, I, I All I do is give to other people. I just give, 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 give. So she's telling me that it's time to just be a little bit receptive and to take things for myself and to be to be happy about it. So, so yeah. And to everybody else, you're going to have a really fucking great cancer season because this is the cosmic... Oh, no, this is creative solution. So the previous card was... Wow. So the previous card, this is what um I was in the middle of talking about when it cut off. Anyway. So this is talking about expressing your creativity. Now, my Divine Feminine Collective, you already had a card about um, your creativity in the previous Karma reading. But basically, this is showing that all of the things that you are creating are actually going to be the solution. So all of the things that you are working hard on, say, for example, if you are doing a lot of art, say, for example, if you are... Uh, channeling your energy into journaling, doing shadow work, all of these things that you're doing is causing causing a massive shift within this 666 portal, which is causing you to actually be able to get everything that you've ever desired. So all of the things that you're creating, especially over this 666 portal, is the solution. This is the solution. You may have been wondering, oh, I know I need a solution. What is the solution? You are the solution. So I guess that this is the oracle card reading, but I wanted to share my good news with you guys first because I didn't know that this was going to happen, but it just shows that anything is possible, anything is achievable, and anything is maintainable because at the end of the day, when you when you set your intentions, when you set your sights on a goal, when you envision something, you can create whatever you want. And that was the last thing that I was saying actually before this, before this cut off. I was saying that whoever is watching this, you are going to be merging the divine masculine and the divine feminine energies to create life. So whether this is a baby, whether this is creative projects, whether this is plants, whether these are animals that you're raising, you're creating life, you're creating solutions for the whole world. I'm proud of you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for choosing me as your oracle card reader. And I will read the affirmation before I go. Sorry about my headdress coming apart at the seams. I made it myself. Um, I wasn't going to tell you why because I wanted but it's to celebrate my pineal gland. So, anyway. Um, so, think outside the box. View things from a higher perspective. That's really lovely because actually earlier when I was talking about Archangel Raziel, I was saying about how I can see that with the angel wings in the background that you are finding that you have already gained your wings behind your back. So you didn't even know that they were growing behind you, but you have become an angel and you have been using these wings and this higher perspective to look over the rest of humanity and to heal it. So wow, wow, look at that. It, it's all, all of these energies are just going together. I will read the affirmations at the bottom of these cards because I'm aware that you may not have been able to see them. And then I will go. Thank you very much for today. Namaste. So the affirmation from Spiritual Gifts by Archangel Raziel is, thank you Raziel for helping me to channel, to channel my gifts and my talents. Now we have got the Divine Feminine Collective, express your creativity. Thank you angels for helping me to express my inner creator. So, there you go. For the Divine Feminine Collective, you are being called to express your inner creator. 
that no, to the divine masculine collective you are being called to share your spiritual gifts with other people because these new expansive gifts that you have been grounding especially to those of you who have been following sacral chakra week and doing the inner work you're going to find that you are able to really shift the whole world around you because of this now to the divine feminine collective you are being called to express your creativity to be really receptive to everything that is trying to come into your life so that you can start to ground your vibration into something meaningful so that you can really express your inner creator in a way that is is freeing and is peaceful for not only yourself but for your whole community now that is everything that i wanted to say for today but thank you very much for watching and i do hope that you have a really great weekend and i hope that the rest of your 66 portal is safe and free from chaos and pain one love one luck and have a really great rest of your time goodbye <laughs>